more fibrous or dense breast tissue a woman has, the lower our sensitivity with mammography. And that's why it's such an important topic in thinking about supplemental screening. When breast density gets high enough to obscure a cancer, we have difficulty detecting it. So mammography can fail in a significant portion of women to find their cancer. So I think the other benefit for patients is they're getting a supplemental screening that doesn't involve radiation. And it's involving a second technology, which I think is an advantage. To use the best of ultrasound and the best of mammography together really gives you an ability to completely evaluate the breasts in a holistic sense. The most important thing that our referral base wants to know is that we're confident in the results that we get with our Invinia screening. The screening indication given by the FDA for this is an indication for them that the techniques that we're using are the very best available to detect breast cancers and to minimize callbacks. Employing ABUS in our own community, we've seen these results firsthand. We've seen cancers that were detected on ABUS that were invisible on the mammogram. And being able to find node negative invasive cancers in these patients really impacted their care and their treatment options. Well, the clinical benefit of ABUS is finding the cancers that mammograms miss.